okay boys so let's fix floating app all right so most of you guys are having challenges making the vpn or any app you want to float okay so um let's fix it let's fix it and uh, the first thing you have to do is make sure you're downloading the floating app from the link i've provided to you inside the link description below so right now i'm downloading floating apps at about 30 megabytes that's approximately 30 megabytes so and some few seconds it should be downloaded it should be downloaded okay so you successfully downloaded the app let's install it let's install the floating apps all right now it's installing in the background now let's go to settings i want to make sure guys you have you guys have these settings enabled so when you've enabled your developer options uh, you guys have to make sure that um these three settings are on that enable free form windows force activities to resizable force desktop mode but if you don't have the other two what we actually need is enable free from windows so if you have only enable free from windows it's okay all right so now let's go back floating apps is installed um let's ground the permissions it needs okay so floating apps need um access to our storage let's grant it all right granted enable drawing of other apps all right so if enable that now for the final thing what we are gonna do is um let's just look for the floating apps okay look for the floating apps and then click on app info click on permissions and then just enable everything it needs okay just enable all of them we are just gonna enable everything because it's needed for the app to function very very well okay so i'm just gonna give everything except maybe location info i don't see what it needs location info for at the moment so i'm just gonna grant everything home screen shortcut show on long lock screen um display pop-up window that's the most important thing all right now um let's open floating windows why all right so we've installed floating windows and you can see that we have this floating at the far top corner let's drag it to the middle here all right so that's just be installing the floating apps and going through all the procedure now this is how you can flip the apps there are several methods so first and foremost we would use the floating icon method okay so when you click on floating icon just scroll okay and then come to favorites all right so this this is how the favorite tab look like let me show you okay so this is the favorite tab all right when you click on this this icon that sends you to the favorite tab all right so what you're gonna do is you're, you're gonna uh we're gonna clean everything okay you're just gonna clean all of them we don't need them you can keep what you need there but i don't need them so um you click on add and then you click goods why is mr Goat? all right so when you click mr goat let's go back all right and uh, click on goat over here you just click and hold on it and then you click sla uh, start in medium window and boom boom it opens in medium window but sometimes the medium window may be too huge so what you're gonna do is just uh open in small window okay so let's open a small window and i think small window is quite better okay small window is quite better now the other way you can uh do it as by um let's disable floating icon okay so let's disable floating icon all right so floating icon is disabled you can see that the icon has uh, disappeared the other method is floating menu okay so once you click on enable floating menu you should see a bar to the left side this area but i don't know why it's not appearing for me but anyways it's the same uh same idea you just clean everything and then you add the apps okay you, you add the app you want to say you want to add um, maybe magic okay and when you click so let me preview it when you click on preview this is how it appears so when you click on magics and then you can start in small window or whatever you want okay so it's the same idea but for some reason it's not showing on my os at the moment i think it's a bug now the final way you can um floats and up is the floating body that's what i prefer okay so with the floating body it's very very simple 
very very it's the most simple out of the various ways so um when you click on it it actually loads a list of um characters now these characters float on the screen at all times so when you click on the character it floats the preferred app you want so let me click on sketch boy i really like sketch boy okay so as you can see sketch boy has appeared here all right sketch boy it's moving on the screen okay so let me go to settings and you can decrease the opacity you can see that sketch boy over here at mine is it my right okay it's a sketch boy is now moving over here you can see that the opacity is increasing and decreasing all right and you can also reduce the size to whatever you want okay you can reduce the size usually i like it very very small so when i click on um you can see that there are a list of tags for me to do okay so let me click on sketch boy then press and load and go to vpm and then click start in small window and boom same function and sketch boy is actually the most easiest way to perform this um, function of floating the desired app you want okay so um the final way to troubleshoot floating app if all the above methods doesn't work is to go to settings okay so you click on settings and um, scroll all the way down click on free form uh, mode free form mode and then you see a list of options just try all of them okay so when i click android 7 then i go back if i'm using the floating body i click on floating body and then test whether it's working okay so android 7 isn't working clearly all right so what i'm gonna do is um i'm gonna go back to my floating apps okay and then change from android 7 to android 8 and then click on body again okay float again in small window and seems like android 8 is working for me let me try android 9 too and see okay so if you want to clear the um, floated app you just swipe it up all right so let me let me try again with android 9 click on floating body or then click on goods start in small window so android 9 and 8 works perfectly for me okay so you can try uh, you can try it out and see if any of them works for you all right so if you have root there is another app okay it's called mi window global small window okay so um i'll leave the link to this inside the link description below okay so you can access it on telegram this is for aos aosp users okay that's custom rom users you just flash it and then you get this fancy looking floating window on your custom room the link will be inside the link description below so make sure to check it out don't forget to like share and subscribe guys see you boys in the next video bye bye peace out